Hi guys, it's Caitlin, and today I'm going to be talking about the supplies I use in my journal. So, I have my journal right here, and then I have, like, all the supplies laid out. Um, so, my journal, I use a bunch of different things in my journal. I've especially been doing this lately, where I just put down some washi tape and then add some Halloween stickers. So I have a few pages pre-decorated. I like how this one turned out. Um, then there's this one, and this is the last one because I don't know how many pages I'm going to fill up um, until Halloween. Um, so that's that. The washi tapes I use are from a few different brands. These ones I got in a kit along with a lot of other ones, which I have a haul video. I don't really remember what brand they are, but I'll put it on the screen, the brand. Um, these are some of my favorites. I like this black and white striped one. It's simple, and I like to match that one up with with the rose one. This one I really like. There's another one with flowers I really like, too. I love this one with arrows. I'm almost out of this one. This one is like a Claire's brand of washi tape, um, and I have some of these, too. But I just like this one with the bows on it. Um, I have like this whole bin full of them. So, these ones I got from Michael's, I know that, the dollar store, like this one, these ones here are from the dollar store. Um, these ones are from Walmart, they're like, they're plastic tape things, so I have a bunch of different tapes in here, and I just keep them in this bin, and go through, and pick. The tapes I'm going to use, I normally like to just pair them up into twos and then use two at a time. The next thing I've been using a lot lately is stickers, since it's Halloween soon. Um, tomorrow, if you're watching this the day it comes out, these are the stickers I've been using. Um, I have this sheet with like different monsters. This one, which I love, with different little ghosts. This one has, like, more monsters. And I got all these from the Dollarama. For $1.25 a piece, I think. And then I got this last year. So I'm just trying to, like, use up these ones some more. These all came from the dollar store. And I, I like to pair them with the, with the tapes. So I did this one with the ghosts and stuff. And that, and then up here is one from the dollar store last year that I had. This one, yeah. So I've been using those a lot. I don't really use stickers too much unless it's a holiday. But I tend to just buy them from the dollar store. So, this stuff. The scissors I use are just from the dollar store. I use those for, like, washi tape. Or when I make pockets and stuff. I have Elmer's glue, just a glue stick that I used to stick things in, and this tape. To just tape stuff down. This is just random Dollarama brand tape that came in a pack of three, so I have that. Then I have like what I use to actually write with. For fine point stuff, I have these Sue Color fine liner pens that I got from um, Amazon. They're not all in here, but they're just a bunch of like fine tip pens. They're just very fine point thing. Next, I just have this giant box of a hundred colored pencils, which I got from Walmart. I haven't really used them as much in this journal as I did some of my other ones. Like my last journal, I did use these a bit for like all my space things I did. But when I do like use colored pencil in my journal, these are what I use. Next, I use these um, Crayola Super Tip markers, and I do these. Um, I use these for like the date in my journal, so when I write the date in my journal, I put it in markers, so there's that one, there's yesterday, which is green, and then um, the day before, which is orange, which is something else, but I will show you what I used for that, and um, I really like them. They don't bleed through the paper of this journal, which I like, and they're, I, I just really like them a lot. The orange header that you've seen for the date, I used this Sharpie highlighter for. 
Um, so I use these for the same things. I use these for which um, these just don't have as much color to them. Now for the pens I use, um, I use this zebra pen if I want like fine point writing. And then I use this one which I got from Kohl's if I want thicker writing. Those are the supplies that I use in my journal. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I'll see you guys next week. Bye!